are you feeling? I'm feeling... How much sleep have you gotten? Um, not much, but no. <laughs> it's a good reason to be tired, though, you know? Yeah. It's, it's been amazing, like, to have that happen, just everything up to that point was just incredible. Yeah, like, well, you, I was watching you on stage. I actually had to look at the monitors because you were so backlit, I could hardly see your expression, <laughs> and I wanted to see whoever won the expression. I was looking, but you looked actually like you were um, physically ill a, a little <laughs> tiny bit. Were you feeling, like, what were you feeling inside before and then yeah, right that's, when... That's about right. Yeah. Well, um, honestly, when, you know, he does the pause, you know, and the winner is, and I was just like, come on, say it, man, say something. And, <laughs> and, uh, and then he said my name, and it was just like this weight was lifted off me, and it was just like the most amazing feeling because, you know, you try so hard and you work so hard at something, you know, and this has been such a long process that um, to actually say that I won is just like, wow, you know? It was, you know, yeah. <laughs> I think people were, were thinking, and, and some people were saying Crystal looked like she was going to be the winner. Were you aware of that? Did you feel that she was ahead for a while and because it, it was back and forth? It's, it's, it's weird, you know, because as you go through the competition, there's so many shifts and changes and, and choices people make that, you know, they, they can have a standout night, and, and they're all so talented. That's the thing. So, I mean, for everybody, I think, when we would go out there, it was like, you know, we'd all be like, man, that was really good. Did you hear this person? And it was... And, Everyone's so talented. So, yeah. for a while, I mean, I, I, Crystal was killing it. And Crystal did kill it, and, and she's amazing. And uh, it could have, yeah, she, yeah, seriously. And, um, it could have been her up there. You know, yeah. it could have easily been her up there. And you know, it, it just happened the way it did. And I'm, I'm really proud of myself. But uh, you know, I'm, I'm really happy for her too. And it's just. I don't know. It's just, you were it's sweet amazing. because you leaned over and, and said, I love you to her. And I think that that's sort of, I think that's why a lot of people fell in love with you because you really are an emotional guy and you show your emotion. Mm -hmm. and, and people fell in love with you watching you. When you finally started smiling, we were like, there's the smile. <laughs> like, you know, enjoy it and let us see mm -hmm. you because you looked so scared every week. And I, mm -hmm. I can imagine that it's scary. Because a year ago, you were literally working in a paint store, right? Yeah, I was. And it's just, you know, looking back at it, you know, then I remember the day I said, I'm going to go do this, you know, and, and just I'm going to take that risk. And I did. And, like, throughout the season, there's been ups and downs for everybody. But mm -hmm. for me, it was actually really good. When, the, when there were down moments, it really helped me figure out, you know, myself a little bit more mm -hmm. because I was able to figure out how to get over those kind of things and, and really let the fears go because that's what really holds you back when you're afraid of something and you don't take the risk. And I right. think that at some point, you know, I, I kind of just told myself, you know, you got to just let loose and just do your thing. Well, I think a lot of people tell themselves that, but it's, it's one thing to say, just get over it, but it's, it's another thing to actually do it. Was, was one of your low moments being on the uh, playing the game know or go here? <laughs> when um, uh. On, uh, we, were, we had uh, Lee and Crystal United here States. Monday. Um, <laughs> See, we help you learn and grow. Uh, they were here Monday helping uh, some big fans uh, out in the oh game. Boy. Norgo, let's remind people of the clip, Lee. Let's. <laughs> Lee, Niagara Falls borders Canada and what country? What's that? Yeah. <laughs> What's that now? Niagara Falls borders Canada and what country? Oh my God. Are you serious? <laughs> Come on, Lee. I'm, I'm, I'm nervous. I don't know. The United States. The United States. <laughs> All right, so. Uh, uh, but then you let me go from there. No, that was fun. Uh -huh. That was fun. Um, uh -oh. I don't know. This That's is, just one of those moments. Listen, yeah. I, I'm just giving you a hard time because the amount of stuff that you have to do every single day on that show that you even had time to come here, much less focus and think about anything. But now you'll never forget that. I won't. I mean, and I, I think a lot of people don't know where Niagara Falls is. So it's okay. Uh, I, yeah, okay. It's okay. Um, Point taken. All right, let's bring out the very talented singer who fought him till the end. Uh, please welcome Crystal Bauer Sox. Hi. And Crystal, how did you feel when you were standing there? You seemed calmer. And what I saw when they were counting down, they, they count down to the going live and they say five, four, three, two, and you were counting along mm -hmm. with it. And you went five, four, three, two, I love you. And you went back and I saw you say I love you to Lee right before the cameras came back. Uh, mm -hmm. You were in your own world. I don't even think you heard it because I saw you just kind of. <laughs> but you seemed calmer than, than I uh, could I, imagine. Yes, anyway. there was, I don't know. I looked up at the confetti falling. I just, I felt 
You know, I can't feel exactly what you felt, but um, I just, I was so happy for you. I mean, it was just a great moment. It was great to see that, too, and I saw, and I think towards the end, I saw more of you, and I think a lot of people, you know, I've, I've talked to felt like they saw more of, of, of you and, and coming through and just your personality on stage, because for a while, I think the, the consensus was she doesn't want it as bad as Lee, but I think you wanted it just as bad. You didn't show it the same way. Right. I mean, of course I wanted it for myself, but um, I, I'm just the kind of person that, uh, not, I mean, nothing, nothing I do in my life is for me except for maybe my, my tattoos, you know? Um, I, <laughs> you know, I just, um, I, I don't know. I'm just that kind of person, and I, I, I can empathize, and, I, you know, I, I felt like I won vicariously through Lee. We've been through everything together since yeah. the beginning. Yeah. And uh, I know how he feels. He knows how I yeah. feel, and... Well, you both, awesome. you both have a career, obviously, no matter um, who would have won. And yeah. I mean, you're both so talented, and you both Thank have you. a huge <laughs> fan base, and I think you're both going to put out great records. And Thank you. Thank you. Make good salad. Yeah, yeah. And, um, salad, anytime. OK. Um, <laughs> And I, I noticed all of a sudden that your boyfriend wasn't there, and then I found out that literally on Tuesday before the finale, you, um, you broke up. Yeah. That's yeah. a hard time to go through a breakup right before... Yeah, it was, it was bad timing, um, you know, yeah. having, you know, breakfast, and he just, uh, you know, I just decided he's a small-town guy, and, you know, I, I don't blame him for anything. He's been amazing. He's been my rock through all this, mm -hmm. so, you know, it's well, all right. That's great. Well, wow, you're a strong, amazing woman to go through that and then still <laughs> keep going.